All right, a weekend activity outlook. We are very happy to show you. Why is that? Because there's nothing but green on it. Nearly perfect conditions for anything. I mean, just about anything you want to do outside this weekend. That includes a trip to the beach. How about mid 70 degree surf temperatures, light waves, Beach conditions could not be any better. Just make sure you're putting on that sunscreen SPF 30 or higher. Remember now that we're getting into the 1st of June, we are at seeing the highest sun angles of the year. If you need to do some gardening, remember water conservatively. That will be a bit of an issue the next few days. There's really not a lot of significant shower or thunderstorm activity in the forecast, but working outside, no problem. Great morning weather. I mean, pretty rare in June. You can say comfortable conditions for a morning run or maybe a morning dog walk. Tomorrow morning, we can absolutely say that with temperatures in the upper 50s and lower 60s. Stray shower possible on Sunday, but still you got to give the green light to a grilling outside and just a light chop if you're going to be boating offshore. So everything coming up green for this weekend outlook. For your evening uh, planner, you've got mostly clear skies. Temperatures will be uh, in the uh, 50s uh, overnight tonight. You can see temperatures will start off in the 70s, but dipping down into the 50s here as we head towards tomorrow morning. And part of the reason why those dew point values running in the lower 50s, unusually dry air for this time of the year. And tomorrow, just like today, mostly sunny skies, a high of 81 degrees. Easterly wind around 5 miles per hour. Look at that sunrise at 6 o'clock in the morning. Uh, temperatures warming up into the low 80s by afternoon, and we'll keep those east winds generally under 10 miles per hour. Current temperature 77 in Wilmington, 77 greens uh, in Greenville, 78 degrees in uh, Florence. Uh, yeah, temperatures running cooler than they were 24 hours ago. Six degrees cooler in Wilmington. I remember just a couple of days ago we hit 90 degrees, and for the last couple of days we've been seeing the temperatures trend downward. It is a little bit warmer though now in Boone. There are some signs of some warmer air building back towards the west that eventually will begin to make its way uh, into the area, but not really that much here over the next couple of days. In fact, our hour by hour model showing temperatures tomorrow morning at seven o'clock, just above that. Uh, 60 degree mark, 61 degrees. We'll probably see the 50s first thing when you wake up, right? Maybe around 5 or 6 a.m., but uh, probably some lower and middle 50s if you're around uh, the I-95 corridor. So might actually be a little bit on the cool, cool side there. Lower 80s for highs tomorrow afternoon. The wind direction is starting to shift to more of a southeasterly direction tomorrow afternoon. And notice by Sunday, it's a little more of a southerly wind. So temperature is not quite as cool as you wake up on Sunday morning. As a matter of fact, we're going to see increasing cloud cover. Should be a little bit warmer, too, <coughs> as we head into Sunday afternoon. First floor digital Doppler. It is quiet at this hour in the satellite radar composite, showing a few high and mid-level clouds making their way across the area, but still a very nice day. 84 with a few more clouds on Sunday, just a slight chance of a stray shower, but gradually we start to see the chance of showers and thunderstorms returning. Humidity returning too. That's why lows will be in the upper 60s and lower 70s heading into next week, and really a definitely a more significant chance of thunderstorms by Wednesday and Thursday, probably upper 80s next week. All right, taking a live look outside and